his life and his service as a police officer is best described as heroic. A sheriff's deputy will not go to jail two years after he roughed up a Bills fan outside New Era Field. Good evening. Kenneth Actel was convicted on several charges back in September. That assault was caught on camera. Nikki Dementri went to Actel's court appearance where his former boss rushed to his defense. Before handing down the conditional discharge sentence, the judge here at Orchard Park Court says this is truly a sad case before me, adding that it's made the community and others look very bad. Tears and hugs in Orchard Park. As the judge said, um, there was no winners here today. But before this, an audible acknowledgement from supporters of former Erie County Deputy Kenneth Actel. As an Orchard Park judge said he would not serve jail time. This in reference to the bloody assault of a Bills fan more than two years ago. I don't know that he'll ever completely move on, but he, he has a new job. And uh, at least for the time being, depending on whether he does appeal and, and how that turns out, he has to accept this, this new reality. Actel was sentenced to one year conditional discharge, each for three counts. Those will be served at the same time. The judge also said he must serve 150 hours of community service over nine months and find him more than $1,000. The judge did not mince his words, though, reprimanding both Actel and Nicholas Belsito for their actions and behaviors. We'll tell you that sitting through something like this rates right up there with the pain and the uncomfortableness of sitting through a eulogy at a, at, a, at a funeral and the good things that were said about Mr. Actel during this are the things that are best said at a retirement dinner when that individual decided it was time for his career to end and not how this one was ended. Sheriff Tim Howard was in court to support his former deputy along with family, friends and former colleagues. Belsito, his supporters and attorneys were there as well. Both sides talked about the hero comment made by Howard in his letter to the judge asking for leniency. I will acknowledge that sometimes heroic behavior isn't always totally appropriate, um, but yet it's intended to benefit others and for the majority of this man's career he worked in a way to benefit others. While Actel did not speak, Belsito did. The victim asked the judge for jail time and an apology from Actel, one he says he never got. Belsito's attorney tells 7 Eyewitness News the sentence was as expected and his client is glad to be moving on from the criminal case. The DA's office did not comment. This isn't the end. There's still a civil lawsuit Belsito has filed against the former Erie County Sheriff deputy. In Orchard Park, Nikki Dementri, 7 Eyewitness News.